Jackson. I am a senior, urban studies major, interdisciplinary. Um, and I went on um, a conference in Mexico City. It was technically hosted by the UN and it's a thematic meeting on financing urban development in the 21st century. Glenn actually uh, made me aware that it exists. I didn't know about it. Um, or I did know about it in some ways, but thought it was, you know, not for me because I didn't know I didn't know what it was for. Um, and I apply I applied at it with encouragement, knowing that um, there was some like the Hubbard Center wanted students to go and do things. And and this, though it is connected to my thesis, I didn't know how much it would inform what I was going to do next. So I thought I'd have to have it all figured out, and that I'd have to, you know, really like know what I'm doing before I can access this sort of opportunity. But that's not how it went. It was, it was a pretty inclusive and encouraging process all throughout. Um, so I'm an Asian Studies major. And so I did apply for funding from that department, which helped me out a little bit. Um, but it was quite an expensive opportunity to pursue. And the Professional Development Fund offered to, they gave me the most they offered, actually. Um, in order to help fund this opportunity. So it covered more than my flight um, and allowed me to not only go, but also go comfortably and safely, knowing that I could learn what I want to learn and be fine. It's an incredible opportunity. It's, it's a, a, they offer a large sum of money, especially considering that the, I think the main thing that's funded our conferences is the students that want to stay even in their country it's totally possible and it's and considering how limited some departments are sometimes it's really a mixed bag in terms of who can access what depending on your major this is a pretty solid sort of dependable opportunity to pursue